friends, today is May 4th, 2020, and it is Monday. Um, I hope you guys are getting a chance to be outside and enjoy the super nice weather that we've been having. Uh, this week, we're going to be thinking about using illustrations and details in a story to describe the characters, the setting, and the events. So something that you could do to show what you know is listen to the story and then maybe draw out the characters. Who are they? What do they look like? Draw out the setting. Where is it mostly taking place? And then maybe draw out what's happening mostly in the story. And then if you want, you can send it to me and let me know how it goes. For math, we're going to be reviewing addition strategies. And this might look similar to what we did last week. So we're going to be using um, number lines and pictures to help us solve a problem. The numbers that we use might seem a little bit easy, but our goal is to practice the strategies, the ways to get there. Because as we get into bigger uh, numbers in the older grades, we're going to have to use strategies to help us solve problems. So you can check out that video and follow along with me. For writing, we're going to continue thinking about opinion writing, because that's something we didn't even get to when we were in school. So for today, I want you to think about your favorite holiday. So my favorite holiday is, maybe it's Thanksgiving, Christmas, St. Patrick's Day, Valentine's Day, um, Labor Day, who knows? Mine's the 4th of July. So I would say my favorite holiday is the 4th of July because, now I'm gonna have to explain my thinking, because my family always grills out and we watch fireworks and I love that. So explain why it's your favorite holiday. And you can share that with me too, using Remind or a text message or Facebook, whatever works for you. Um, this week for phonics and our spelling words, we're gonna be thinking about long O. So O, W and O, A make the long O sound, like in show, so sh, O. So we would use an O, W or road. R, O, D, road. O, A usually is in the middle or the beginning of a word, and O, W is typically towards the end of a word. Of course, there's exceptions to these rules, but in general, O, A is in the beginning or middle. O, W is usually at the end. Um, if there is anything else that you need from me, if you have any questions, please feel free to let me know. I miss you guys so much and it was so nice getting to talk to you um, over Zoom and I hope we can do that again soon. Alright, talk to you soon. Bye!